Hello guys and welcome back to the Minecraft modern tutorial. Today's tutorial and for the next few videos I'm going to be showing you how to create your own dimension using Forge and the Dimension API. So, to start with you'll need to check you've got the right version of Forge as the Dimension API only works with uh, Forge 203 or below. So if you've got any higher than 203 then you'll need to change it and to find out what version you've got you need to go and you can just go ahead and launch Minecraft using Eclipse and if you see Minecraft Forge it says 4.0.0.200 so that it, that number at the end if it says 204 or higher then you need to decompile a lower version of Minecraft so I've got version 200 so I'm going to go ahead and quit and now what you need to do as I said once you've set, uh, set up Forge and everything like that you need to go ahead to the Pundles Dimension API version 6.1 on Minecraft forums then you need to scroll down and you'll see downloads you'll see the Forge edition you don't want to download that because that is the class files you want the uh, source files so you need to go down here and go for this bit called four modders then you'll need to go into this Forge bit and so if you're using Forge you can get these patch sources here so just click on that little bit here then download and you can go ahead and open this now what you need to do using your search engine you need to go to your folder where all your source code is kept so mine's on in the folder YouTube example forge so this is where my source folder jars and everything is so you need to go into the source so you just click on it and what you need to do you need to drag everything from the zip file just into the folder and it should say do you want to merge these folders source and source that's because this folder just here is source and this folder just here is source click yes then click yes to that as well click yes then you need to click do this for the next seven conflicts and just do copy and replace because you want to copy the new files from the download into your source folder so now once you've done that I'm getting errors this is because it hasn't updated yet so what you'll need to do is you'll just need to wait a few seconds until it's built workspace and as you can see the errors are going that's because it's finding the right classes so once you've done once you've once it's found other classes and you've got no errors that is it so now you can go ahead and start modding with uh, dimensions you can model dimension API and in the next video I'm going to be showing you how to actually start your dimension so that's going to be it for this video guys I hope it was helpful and if you want more of this dimension series then just give it a like to show your appreciation and it will tell me that you want more of this so that's going to be it for this video guys peace